Okay, uh, let's talk about Windows now. Um, because you should have your doors put in. And I, I've got my door tags turned off just to make it easier to, to see what's going on here. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to drop in some windows that were created from another AutoCAD drawing that came from the window manufacturer. And we're going to drop them in and copy them uh, instead of using the design center, mainly because I think they look nicer. Okay, so, but what you'll want to do is uh, take the dimensions from the textbook that show the window locations and put a construction line like this. And I just made them a couple of feet long. Uh, but put those construction lines in because we'll end up using them to dimension to and centering our, our window tags and things on. And I would recommend going around and, go, and just put all of those in first pull some dimensions to them, make sure you got them in the right location, okay? Uh, now, don't, don't freak because I've, I've got 6 foot 10 here and then the book has 6 foot 11. Uh, this, this iteration of the, was from another, from an older class and we used a, a thicker wall uh, in doing this. So, it, the dimensions may be a little different in some of my videos. Uh, but drop those uh, in as you go around. Now I've got one in place right here. Now the file you're going to want to open, and it's in uh, in Blackboard. It's called the WinQuest Double Hung Window, and it's just a standard AutoCAD file that's got windows already created. If you've never seen a window chart, size chart, uh, this is what one looks like. And so across the top will be your width measurements. This is going to be the, the RO stands for rough opening, or in the case of a vinyl window, that's the nominal window size. Okay, uh, and then you got your other things here, you, your glazing size, frame size, things like that. Okay, so the widths go across. Now, you notice, uh, and, and, and if this were uh, traditional wood frame windows, the rough opening size would be different from the window size, okay? I just, they're manufactured differently. So what we would call a three foot wide window in a vinyl window has a three foot rough opening, okay? Because windows are, are specified, they have their, like their series number, this VKDH, uh, the VK is the model of the window, DH meaning double hung. The first number is 26 means it's a 2 foot 6 wide window. 30 means it's a 3 foot 0 inch tall window. And we look at the chart going down the side has all our height measurements. Okay. Now for this uh, particular lesson, I've given you a window schedule. That has the type of windows and the width and the height and the tag number based on the sample floor plan drawing that I've given you also. Uh, so we're dealing with some three foot wide uh, double hunks, both windows A and windows C. So we're just going to kind of come down here. This is a three foot width and I just want to copy that. I'm going to go uh, control shift C, and I'm just going to copy it and bring it into my drawing. Oh, I'm still on the door layer, so let me just drop it. And it goes on the A glaze layer, glazing. Oh, okay, so this part is a block. Um, we may have to explode it and edit it. Let's look at it and see here. That is five and a half. Yes, because that needs to be four and three quarters. So what we'll do, block editor. Man, that's a nasty color, isn't it?
Okay, I need to make it a half inch smaller. So, I guess the easiest way to do that. is grab each of the handles there okay and that looks Okay, uh, if you wanted to convert this thing into a dynamic block, you could do that, you know, if you wanted to. Um, but I'm okay with that. I made my, uh, let me just check it. Oh, I didn't move it far enough, so. Need to move it three quarters of an inch, not a half inch. Four and three quarters. Okay, and now we'll close our block editor. And we're going to save it. All right. And now I can drop it in place on my wall. Okay. And you'll, you'll do that all the way around. And you can rotate it at whatever angles you need. Um, and all of our double hungs are three foot O oh, with the exception of these front windows here in which we've got a three foot o or excuse me a one foot six double hung a three foot o picture window and a one foot six double hung and what i did i edited it i i took two of them and mashed them together and just created a new a new block okay where you could draw it either way is fine okay so let's go back to here uh what i would do now is trim um, and I want to trim against, before we do that, let's go draw order and send the window to the back so that the wall is actually on top. <clears throat> now we'll trim and I'm going to trim against the window. Uh, I don't know what is going on with that. Okay. Looks like it trimmed it out. All right. So tell real quick. Yeah. Okay. And so just like with the doors, uh, you can get all your windows placed in, trim them, turn that layer off, and then you can close in the walls. Okay. Now the window tag. Uh, it's going to be the same way. Oh, glaze identity. Multi leader. I'm going to create a new one. Window tag. Start with door tag. Continue. And here we want to change this from circle to hexagon. Everything else should stay the same. And I line it up on that construction line and pull it outside. I, you can, you're going to end up moving them anyway, but they need to be a. I can't remember the measurement. We'll look at it and see. Uh, this was a window type A. Now with windows. Doors, doors are all numbered 
sequentially in order, one, two, three, four, five, six, like that. Windows are numbered by type, okay? Because a type A window is a type A window no matter where it is in the building. Whereas a, a door, you may have a different lock set, you may have different hinges, uh, it may swing left, it may swing right, it may swing in, it may swing out. So doors are numbered sequentially, one, two, three, four. Windows are by type, okay? Uh, and so you'll want to do all of your, uh, get all your door tag, all your window tags put in. Uh, and once you place an eight, you can copy them. I mean, it's no big deal. You get them in place and you can copy uh, the stuff and move it around. Okay, so that was uh, doors and windows. That's a lot, eh? It's good. It's all good. It's coming together.